this is Kelly from Crafty Kelly's at www.craftykelly.co.uk. Um, I brought you in one of my previous videos how to make the gift box for my miniature card gift box set, which is this one. Check out how to make this box for these beautiful little cards. Um, it fits four cards and four envelopes, like so. And it's just like a really nice little gift. If you've got any miniature pens, a little miniature pen would fit perfectly in there. Um, they're just great little cards to have um, and really simple to, if you've got any leftover cardstock. Um, I purchased the envelopes from Amazon, um, but you could make them if you've got an envelope punch board. So I'm going to pop those to one side. Today I'm going to show you just how I created this little card. I'm using the Daisy Delight stamp set. You don't need a lot for this. I have used one stamp from the Jar of Love, which is the little beetle, which has got a die cut to cut it out which I have already done ready for this card just a little tip whenever you cut anything out using your big shop I always cut out extras so in here I've got some um, shapes I've got birds I've got balloons hot air balloons um, butterflies just and some more of our little our little beetle guy um, just saves on time if you've got a spare bit of card that you're gonna throw away see if you can get something out of it so I've always got extras then it just makes putting some cards together really quick and simple saves on doing it for each individual card so all we need for that is a very small piece of scrap you can fussy cut and cut it out yourself um, if you are happy to do so but I've got the cut the die cut so I've done it so we've got a small piece of whisper white which is seven centimeters by ten centimeters our miniature card base is 14.9 centimeters by ten and a half centimeters so that is just half of our normal card base I'm just scored down the center at seven and a half centimeters so fantastic and that just fits on there so this is a really simple easy card to make you could make a, a large version if you wanted we are doing a miniature so for this miniature card I'm going to start with my crushed curry which is going to be the back color of my flowers this is a two stamp process um, quick and simple so I'm gonna just do uh, a couple of the flowers like so I'm going to use my daffodil delight to do the more detailed second stamp They do line up quite nicely. You can take more time over this than I am. Like so. That's that done with. I have created a small mask, which I've used several times, uh, just so I can do my green so then I'm just going to use my garden green you can use any green that you've got it's just a particular green I like and I'm just going to pop that over the top so I can try and line up alright didn't line up as well as I should have done. Um, so I've got I've masked this one already. Let's do you first. And let's try and get this one over a bit so. I'll try and 
not get ooh. Leaves everywhere. There we go. So I've just used this very quick masking technique there which I do show in lots of my other videos. We're doing our happy birthday in the garden green. And I'll move it over just a little bit. There we go. one here and I'm going to do one just there so the way I'm going to colour these in is I'm just going to use a blender pen and I'm going to use Bit of crushed curry just get a bit of the yellow in there it's just to make them look a little bit like these and then I'm going to use just a little bit of grey on their wings I'm only dabbing it on slightly. I'm not making it a block colour. So we need to attach our card to our card base. I'm just going to pop a little bit of Tombow on. You can use fast fuse Tombow, uh, snail, whatever is your preference. I prefer to use fast fuse or snail, but mine have both run out. So I can't do that at the moment. Um, for this, I'm just going to use um, a small piece of foam, with, uh, like a 3D foam. To attach this, let's make sure that that's not too big. So I've just used a small piece of 3D foam or dimensional to just lift that off. And there we go. So, I've got a little bit of green on there, but you can take your time. I'm a bit of a messy stamper. And here we go with our lovely little miniature card using the Daisy Delight stamp set. Um, and that's just one idea you can use for this little gift box. So this has been Crafty Kelly showing you how to make some miniature cards for the miniature card box gift set. Um, coming shortly will be other ideas and uh, inspiration for you to create miniature cards. Um, but this has been with our Daisy Delight set today. You could make this card in a full size and it would look just as beautiful. Hope that's given you some ideas but thanks very much for watching. And check out my blog at www.craftykelly.co.uk. Have a great day now. Bye.